Hello, this is Maria Bodenschatz, your ACE English Department Liaison from Pennsylvania Highlands Community College. Thank you for your involvement with our ACE program. We appreciate your extra effort which gives your students the opportunity to gain college credits while still in high school. This video is to talk about our assessment process for the English Department. The assessment serves as a means of collecting information from both our on-campus faculty and our ACE faculty to determine what was taught well and what needs further development. When classroom assessment becomes an integral part of the instructional process, an essential ingredient in efforts to help students learn, the benefits of assessment for both students and instructors are unlimited. For the English 110 Composition 1, we'll be collecting assessment on the research paper assignment. Each of these assessments has six areas that we would like you to rate given three choices, yes, partly, or no. The 110 assessment will ask you to evaluate grammar, organization, structure, types of sources used, amounts of sources, in-text documentation format, and in-text documentation amount. You'll need to complete the assessment spreadsheet for each of your classes. It will ask you to supply the following info. Your name, the course name, how many students you had enrolled in the class, and how many have completed the research paper assignment. Then you fill out a row for each student that includes their name and rates them with a 2, which is yes, 1, partly, or 0 for no for the six assessments. Once this spreadsheet is completed, you will need to upload it through the MyPeak system. Additionally, you will need to submit three sample student papers. An example of a work showing mastery, A or B level, mid-level, a low B or C, and an example of failure to meet the learning objective, a D or F. The intention is to gather examples of students mastering the learning objective, nearly mastering it, and failing to master the objective. Please remove the student's name from each sample. You will also need to save the file with the requested file name format on the site. As you will need to include student samples, please make sure that you make a copy of the necessary example papers, if you're not collecting them digitally, before returning them to your students. Please do try and get your assessment file submitted as soon as you can after completing an assignment, but ideally within a few weeks. We do realize that this is a tedious process to enter this info, and we do appreciate the effort. This is an important aspect of teaching at Penn Highlands, and our faculty are required to complete these. You can reach me anytime by email. I hope that you have a great school year, and thanks again for teaching an ACE course.